Hello everyone, I am Gabriele, welcome to my channel. Today I keep playing Pax Philosaurus, oh sorry, no, Carnotaurus, uh, a true strength in game. Uh, it's a terrestrial, it's good against uh, uh, small prey, again. It cannot, it is not that strong against groups or against bigger prey. It's uh, Carnotaurus, come on. And, uh, you can put up a decent fight. I mean, uh, virtually speaking, with a perfect diet from uh, uh, the moment you spawn until the very end, it takes roughly two hours to grow a Carnotaurus with a perfect diet. It's not a long time. It's uh, it's quite a decent amount of time. You cannot put up. Uh, you cannot. You can put up a good fight against a Tenontosaurus, but again, Tenontosaurus it takes one hour and forty, one hour and forty-five minutes. Uh, to grow and Tenotosaurus as a herbivore usually same tier ish animals are um, mm, herbivores are stronger slightly against Carnotaurus against uh, herbivores against carnivores sorry sorry I um, my brain lagged for a bit because uh, I wanted to uh, use a very aggressive approach against these bushes just in case you never know what lays below the uh, bushes when you have a carcass nearby i did name this carcass what's that Euteraptor. okay Euteraptor. all right poor Euteraptor fell off the cliff can i oh i can grab this now all right i can grab little Euteraptor. oh it's been a while so I'm gonna take this Euteraptor as a banner, as do not approach this uh, uh, killing machine. Did I destroy this Euteraptor? Nah, but it's alright anyway. There must be some Paxiflosaurus around. Dropping this one here, because I don't see, um, I don't like what I see there. Is that pumpkins? I think so. It is pumpkins. So, I'm pretty satisfied with being on a one nutrient diet. It's not perfect, it's not great, but it will do. It will do. Uh, Unless I am starving and I have the right conditions to be on a perfect diet, then uh, yes. All right, two carcasses, another one here. If it's another Euteraptor, there must have been a skirmish around. Utah versus Pakis, I guess. I mean, I hear a lot of Pakis. Little Carno, all right. Little Car, little Carnotaurus. I wonder where those uh, very l la uh, n noisy Pakisphalosauruses are. I see one. I see you. Oh no, that's uh Come on, that that was a very bad Where are you? Where are you? I thought I could I, I hit that Tenno player, but no, I didn't. I'm trying to see where he is. Actually Tenontosaurus can be good. Can I sniff those trucks? I'm trying to sniff those trucks. Well, I lost a Tenotosaurus. It must be in these bushes, but uh, Tenotosaurus, that Tenotosaurus is not gonna put up a fight. It's uh, gonna stand still in there. And uh, yeah, I mean, it's good that nutrient, but I'm not looking for nutrients. I'm looking for skirmishes. So, little nutrient, you are free to go and become a formidable Tenotosaurus. Now, S shape uh, uh, lines nutrients instead might be a deer or a Dryosaurus. Yeah, it's gonna be a deer. Not many players do uh, Dryosaurus. So, it's gonna be a deer somewhere. Deer, in fact. And there is some other carcass, either Carnotaurus or Euteraptor. Okay. Um. There must be some solo party around that is bringing havoc to everything that moves. Or, uh, I don't know, a lot of food around, but no skirmishes. You see why sometimes uh, uh, playing little... Uh, um, playing uh, juveniles sometimes is more fun than playing uh, the big ones because uh, not many players want to play with you. You cannot find many players uh, your same size uh, that uh, you can fight with. It's, uh, it's rare. 
everyone reach uh, their 100% uh, growth stage and they become attached to it no I cannot lose it or oh, no if I get into a skirmish now I will lose it I mean it is a bit annoying that's uh, that is true but uh, you see uh, um, shall we do bowling shall we do bowling we do bowling one two and three charging one two and three there was nothing there was nothing I mean, uh, big Stegosaurus, usually, Paxiphalosaurus players go around uh, Stegos. Even though that is the strongest, possibly, mixed pack that is not Apex uh, mixed packing, Dino and Stego, around. Oh no, why are you here? Is this enough? Is this enough? Run away, I mean, uh, someone does this to me and I run away. It's not even talking. Probably wants to uh, to perish. It's not even talking. All right. Well, there we go. Food too big to swallow. Not even talking and making the friendly call. All right. Um, one less Carnotaurus. Thank you so much for this food. Then S shape nutrient will get me back on. Oh, Pteranodon. How much do you want to bet? It's gonna uh, peck at me. No, 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 there is a Stegosaurus around. I do not want to get destroyed by the car. Oh, I'm not gonna move. I'm not even gonna waste stamina on that one. You know what? A bit, a bit, a bit, a bit. Little annoying Eutheraptor. Little annoying Eutheraptor. Let me eat the Carnotaurus. Gonna eat a bit. Uh, little Eutheraptor will come back, definitely. I'll be kind of surprised if they didn't. They should, they, they are coming back. Oh, nice. I am on a great diet. If if I were smart enough to catch that uh, uh, finished little Carnotaurus. No, still here. Still here. So Carnotaurus was here. And now some other S-shaped nutrient. I ignore what that is, but it's going to be alright. I'm just checking. I'm just checking if there is a Eutheraptor around. So, night is coming. A ton of food around. This is Carnotaurus. Looks like a Carnotaurus, right? Is he a Carnotaurus? I think so. It is a Carnotaurus. So, a bit more. I need to eat a bit more. And then, water. It is. I need water. So, there is kind of a safe slash not safe spot. I'm, I'm gonna say safe because not many dinosuchus ambush there at least i don't because it's on land or uh, half land so i don't it's not my favorite spot where to ambush but it's a hot spot nevertheless you need to be careful it is there it is there i'm going there i'm going there night vision on of course night vision on and then i'm going there just, just to drink, just for a drink, just for a drink, just for a drink. Okay, drinking. Now, uh, water here is very shallow. If any Dinosuchus were to walk here, I would hear them. And uh, I'm gonna turn my heels and uh, run back to land. So, that is why I'm saying it's kind of a safe spot where to drink. It's, uh, you are surrounded by Dinosuchuses. But, again you uh, have a very short piece of land that is very shallow this is center hotspot every dinosuchus spawned there and in fact it's full of dinosuchuses i need to oh they didn't use lunch they did not use lunch I'm not in a very good position though. I just charged that damn. Imagine 1.8 tons uh, charging against that 8 tons animals. Not very smart, is it? That's why I'm resting. And of course, interrupters are around. Now, this kind of sucks, honestly. I'm gonna stand still and uh, not moving. I didn't see those interrupters earlier. If I did, I wouldn't have attacked those uh, uh, Dinosuchus. I'm gonna stand still then. Not moving. Uh, they are eating. They are on my radar. What's my uh, bleeding pool though? 89%. Yeah, not good. 
I worry about my bleeding. I need to uh, have a good bleeding pool before facing Eutheraptors. Those Eutheraptors are on the uh, on top of of that, so it, it's uh, yeah. I need to be careful. Is the other one still eating? I need to catch them eating because that's when they are most vulnerable. It's two of them. I do not want to bleed. I do not want to bleed any longer. They are very agile. If I manage to surprise them, I'm gonna be pretty satisfied. At least, I don't know, it's uh, the skirmish I was looking for. Right, I can't wait anymore. I'm gonna stand up. And move silently towards them with crouch. With crouch. I am bleeding, that's the bad thing. Yes! One down and the other one ran away. They, they are little ones though. They are little ones! Eutheraptor and Stegosaurus, or just Stegosaurus that walk up and uh, let the little ones eat while uh, Carnotaurus was around. I thought they were big Eutheraptors. Well, again. Small prey hunter. I thought they were big. My bad. Well, what was these Dinosuchus doing up here? I'm not gonna face uh, that. Wait, no, no way. Ha, <laughs> miss! You missed me, you missed me! Ypsilophodon, I'm gonna run away because Ypsilophodon can actually blind me and uh, if I have a lag hit, then uh, Stegosaurus can do the rest, so... Yeah, no thank you, you know. Oh, I didn't see that one! I didn't see that one. That's why sometimes uh, um, darker skins might be good. You have uh, the camouflage magic on your side, so darker skins are good, above all at night. I didn't see that one for real. Uh, okay, I'm going to the mighty northwest. I have full everything. I'm I'm pretty I'm pretty good. I'm pretty good. This Carnotaurus is pretty good. So um, so far, only small prey. I I haven't faced any Tenotosaurus. I haven't faced any uh, group of Pachys. I don't count. Uh, 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 single pack is to be uh, same tier as me, they need to be three or two. Two packies can uh, take down a, a Carnotaurus if, if performance is good, if performance is on your side. And uh, if performance is perfect, flawless on uh, all possible sides, then yes, packies do not stand much of a chance. Uh, Carnos, single Carno cannot stand much of a chance against two packies just because they are ag more agile than Carno. But it depends on the amount of stamina you consume, on what they manage to break uh, uh, at first. Uh, otherwise, the Carnotaurus will win over the Pachys. The two Pachys. Just because it depends. It depends. All fights depends on many things. Uh, they are all situational in a sense. So, I need to keep in mind that there is some mod pool down there. So, mod pool my lifesaver if I am fighting against a group of Eutheraptors. Eutheraptors don't deal damage on my pool mainly, well they do on my HP, but they deal a lot of damage on my bleeding pool. So you can fight uh, Eutheraptors with uh, a low, a I mean with half HP so to say. Uh, if your bleeding pool is good uh, you don't have many things to worry about as a Carnotaurus as a fully grown Carnotaurus, I'm saying. You just have to worry about bleeding pool. Your bleeding pool will deplete much faster than your HP, than your uh, uh, life pool. So, northwest. Northwest, here we go. For the night is dark and full of terrors. Um, probably I will find some other skirmish. And nobody wrote actually nothing in chat so far. Uh, I wonder why people... Uh, uh, I mean, uh, small Carnos, going back on before, that small Carno made the friendly call with the F button, but didn't write anything in chat, and then stood there, even though I beat a couple of times. Must be like, uh, please, I wanna switch playable, I wanna, I wanna change, I do not want to play Carnotaurus anymore. Otherwise, I cannot explain that behavior, it's uh, not very safe, is it? I mean, uh, it's not at all. And they pay dearly. I mean, they wanted to switch playable anyway. Otherwise, I cannot explain that to myself. All right. I hear Pocky. 
I think I heard a Pocky. Now, I'd rather fight a group of Pockies than a group of Uteraptors because of Bleeding Pool. Even though, three Pockies can be as formidable as a Uteraptor. Blunt damage versus Bleeding Damage. Fracture damage versus Bleeding Damage. It can be as formidable if uh, they manage to fracture my head, then my legs, and then my body. I'm, I'm gonna be done for... Okay, there is some food over there. I wanna go and check. That's deer or Drio or Driosaurus. It's on the other side of the... Sorry, of the river. Do I wanna check? I don't. It's by the forest. I don't like f being too close to the forest. Um, so, that's the river. I wanna keep sniffing. And uh, I'm gonna head towards... Uh, the true heart of Northwest. Those rocks around the river. Everyone goes there. All Uteraptors, all Pakis. It's a safe spot for them. Even Thanos, sometimes, if they are surrounded by uh, Carnos. But again, one Tenonto is stronger than one Carnotaurus. Skirmish wise, herbivores of the same or uh, uh, similar tier. Kinda, they are stronger than their carnivore counterpart. Carnivores can go faster, carnivores can uh, ha mm, escape, so to say. Herbivores cannot have the luxury of running in order to escape successfully, because they are slower than carnivores. Then uh, you might find yourself in a situational fight, in a situational escape, where, uh, I don't know, you cross a river as a herbivore, and uh, you are safe and sound because uh, just in that moment Adinosuchus is passing by Charging I hit something Did I? Yeah, Uteraptors I wanna play Oh, I beat that one, I beat that one, alright I hope I uh, made them they side to f make to follow me. You know what? I'm gonna head towards a bush just in case and sitting down here and wait what they do. Sometimes this can be a good strategy. And then silence. Sometimes silence help. I think I have been either beaten or pounced. 47, 42, 39. 37, 34, so I'm losing 0 0.0302 21, 18, 15, 15. Yeah, f okay Yeah, I'm losing I'm losing uh, I'm losing uh, blood fast That's why uh, you want to sit down and rest I'm sitting down and resting I'm going there a bit later But I need to be healing this, uh, this wound so, if you sit down and rest, you are not, uh, I mean, you are more vulnerable because you are sitting down, so you need to find a safe spot. Again, this is not that safe of a spot because I am kind of nearby that Uteraptor uh, hive, I don't know how to call that. So it's not that safe, but I'm hiding and those Uteraptors do not feel uh, to follow me, they didn't follow me. 84. Come on, I'm bleeding th this much. I mean, uh, was it one pounds or one bite? Or more than one bite? Hmm. I don't know. I need to be careful. So, if uh, uh, they were becoming for me, they're gonna come from that way. Alright, uh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good to go. What's my uh, blood level? 96. Good. 93, 23, 37. Alright. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna stand back up. Then sniff my surroundings. I just want to know where some blood is, or where some uh, corpse is. All over there. Do you see that? Do you see the blood over there? On my north heading, kind of there. Or on my south heading over there. That must be the Uteraptor I bit earlier on. So I, I want to charge like there. Between the bushes and the rock, where uh, some of them will be hiding. Here we go. Uh, I wanna go uh, and charge at the very last moment here for example and they are not here anymore it's uh, it's there you see it is still bleeding well 
There is nothing much I can do. There is nothing much I can do now. They are there. Uh, can I steal their... Uh, what they have done? Oh, that's all Dinosuchus. That's all Dinosuchus food. Is this a Dinosuchus? Yeah, that's a big Dinosuchus. Oh, man. What's happened? A lot of dead Dinos carcasses. Here we have a group of very active Dinosuchus players, you know? I mean, killers. Killers! I need to sniff there to know where those interrupters are. Did they move away? They are still there, I bet. Usually, interrupters, they don't move. They feel safe and cozy. So, I'm keeping this camera because uh, I want to see if I can buy them. I don't think I can buy them, but can I go upwards? It's three Uteraptors, four, three Uteraptors and a half, one is a later one. They can do wonders against me, actually it's, f uh, yeah, three big ones and one not so big, and one not so big, you know, and one not so big, so I'm gonna fall back. Uh, the one up there can still see me and they are saying, alright, he's coming back. Oh, I think I beat that one. I think I beat that because it's moving away. And they do not want to engage. They do not want to engage. If they do want to engage, I will fall back. But for now, I just need to move away. Um, I need to understand if the one that is playing as, uh, I mean, as the scout, I guess. Is, uh, can see me against the sky probably they can they can actually be they could play very aggressive against me if they wanted they have all of the cards oh someone got scared huh? oh you managed to bait me that one that one managed to bait me all right to bite me Oh, I hate bleeding with Carnotaurus against these raptors. So I'm gonna move away and I'm gonna wait for their move. Where to? Same place as before. It was a good spot and it's gonna be a good spot still. It's coming back here. I can't believe that. Alright, well, there is more pull around. Yep, yeah, no way, no way. Alright, you know what? I'm going back. That one is there to make me lose time. There is two, another two of them. Um, so I'm gonna sniff there one. As soon as it comes to me, I will try to. I'm sniffing there because so my head doesn't give away uh, where I'm looking at. You know what? If I have to waste stamina, you will too. Uh, no, I need to go back to. Uh, so you see, I'm I'm moving. I'm I'm I do not give away where I'm looking at. So I'm going away to um, to mod pool to uh, get back my blood. And that interrupter is still following me now. My best case scenario is to bite as soon as they will try to pounce me from my back. At least, at least I want to try that. They won't be able to see me in a moment now. Alright. Yeah, that's. Uh, they are way too agile for you to counter them. So, so sniffing there. I do not want to give them away uh, what I'm looking at. So it's one. Soon enough, it will be more than one. But again, uh, they cannot do anything with uh, against a Carnotaurus. That uh, is kind of good with their food and uh, uh, water. I already... Uh, it's two of them, in fact, now. One tried to make me lose time. Now it's coming back. It's time for me to run. I need to find that mod spot. That mod pool where I can face them. Um, you cannot pounce. Uh, uh, you cannot use any special ability around mod pools. So, if you can, use that to your own advantage. Check how much a little pounce and one bite make 
uh, made uh, me lose blood. I mean, it's a huge amount if you really think about it. A huge amount. So, I'm gonna broadcast for the good and the bad. This is a challenge and I need to accept this. I wonder if they will follow me or not. I I'm gonna uh, play around the mud pool anyway. Just in case, just out of safety. Alright, this is good. I'm not bleeding anymore. I'm just gonna wait for them to pass by. Or probably they already folded back. You never know if they folded back. This is my trap set up. If they decided to follow me. Now, every time you crouch, you make less sounds when you move and uh, you are not leaving footprints as far as I understand. So, it's true that uh, I moved only the last part. So, <sighs> HP good and uh, bleeding pool very bad. Oh, gotcha! I got that! I got that! They must be thinking, oh, that was a good ambush! It was a good ambush! And now, uh, I need to find that mod pool. Come on, should be somewhere over here, the mod pool. Oh, here we go! Safety! At last, safety! And, uh, oh, I'm gonna press E, wallow in mod. They can uh, be here and try to bite me. I'm gonna wallow in mod anyway. Just because, just out of spite against them. Did I bite it, by the way? Um, I am. I'm wondering if I managed to bite that Eutheropter. I'm gonna sniff my surroundings. At least I I gave a good scare to that Eutheropter player. That's enough for me, you know. That's enough. Even if uh, they uh, come on. Aha, uh -huh, they knew it. Alright. No. They managed to bite me again. Alright, the fight is on then. You know what? I'm gonna crouch if I can. I'm gonna stand still as much as possible. Um, if only I could sit down. It's two of them. It is two of them. So, um, two of them. One, two, three. Alright, three. It's alright though. And uh, they're not gonna move. So, I'm gonna sniff the air. So my head. I want you to sniff the air, Carnotaurus. Can I sniff while I am in the mod pool? Doesn't look like I can. One, two. Now, if you keep doing like this, they will know where you look at. But again, they will be more careful. They, they will try to uh, jump from that side. And one bites the dust. Actually, bites the mod. Okay, one broadcast to let them know Who's boss? Carmotaurus is boss. Again, try that again to pants me while I am in a mud pool. I'm gonna savor this moment. Just uh, again, I know they are watching. Oh, that's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Um, my, uh, I didn't wallow in mud properly, but again, it's alright. Uh, this uh, mod coverage won't last as long as uh, any other because uh, I quit uh, earlier on. Oh, it's gonna be good, very good actually. To sever this one. I will leave it there. That's that's your that's your fella. That was a bit too aggressive against the might of Carnotaurus. One down and another one to go. I'm gonna I, I will need to wallow in mod again now. Alright. Now wallow one. To just need to check my surroundings. They they are in that bush probably, you know. They are in that bush. I am kind of scared they might come out. My bleeding pool sucks now. Okay, I need to charge at that if possible. Alright, there is none of them. Well, Probably that interrupter died and the other two fold, folded back. I would. I would. Oh, oh, come on. Food. I have food at least now. Food for me. That's why uh, Carnotaurus is still mighty strong against interrupters. 
every single playable has their territory. Youth Raptors, they rely on Prairie more than anything now. On time, as usual, you might say. I mean, time must be on a Youth Raptor hands, even though bleeding is kind of good, very good. You don't need that much time to bleed out your opponent. And uh, Carnotaurus players, they rely on mod. You are a mod monster, the monster of mod. Carnotaurus. Uh, well, you know what? That's all for today. Thank you all so much for watching. Consider subscribing my channel. And uh, have a great day. Bye-bye.